what has YouTube done for me? That's a good question. Hey y'all, I missed ya. Okay, I didn't really go anywhere, but it's been like a whole 48 hours since I posted something and so I just missed you guys. I was tagged by Emily plus three to explain how YouTube has kept me accountable. This could actually really be pretty much anybody, any process, doesn't specifically have to be Dave Ramsey. So I'm gonna tag Lindsay over at Lindsay's Frugal Life. Lindsay is not actually a Dave Ramsey person, but she is paying off a crap ton of debt. She's trying to bail herself out of school loan debt and it's just completely admirable. She's single, she's awesome, upbeat. So I'm gonna link her channel down below. Make sure you go check her out and I probably better let her know that I'm tagging her. Where would I be without the accountability of YouTube? I don't think I would have paid off as much debt as I have to begin with, first of all. Second of all, I don't think I would have lost as much weight as I have. Yeah, it's not just Dave Ramsey for me. It's actually everything. You guys hold me accountable. You guys make sure I stay on the great, the straight and narrow. I work hard. I'm, I'm a naturally hard worker, go-getter kind of person, but sometimes when I get frustrated, I give up. And I know that on this plan, having this channel, there's very little I'm gonna give up on because I don't like to admit failure publicly, ever, never. This is kind of a hard video to do because YouTube just keeps me accountable. I can't explain how I do it. I just do it. And I guess getting out there and having to admit publicly that I didn't do something I set out to do or that I didn't reach one of my goals would is enough for me to keep me going. So like for example, let me talk to you about this more regarding Elizabeth Benton because this is where I am really prone to failure. With Dave Ramsey paying off debt, paying off debt right now is not an option for us. If Mauricio and I ever wanna move forward with our life, we have got to pay off debt. We have the means to do it right now. It's a little more difficult, but we actually can do it. But losing weight, this is where YouTube is really keeping me accountable. And let me tell you why. I have been struggling. I lost 75-ish pounds uh, about 18, 20 months ago. And I've kept that off and I've done great keeping it off. I have more weight to lose, but it's really a struggle for me. And this is where I am finding myself the most accountable for YouTube. Because for example, I started this program with Elizabeth Benton and I noticed in about week seven, my enthusiasm kind of went and tanked. And normally that would be when I would give up. But because I know I am going to have to get on here and talk to you guys and explain my choices and what I'm doing and, and how everything's going, because I know I have to do that, I found it very easy to get back on the wagon because I fell off, yes, week seven was a disaster. There were cookies involved. But because I knew I have to report that to you guys, I kind of did. And within a week, I was back on and I'm down eight pounds. I'll see you in the next one. See ya. What's up, my favorite friends? I am so happy you're here with me today. I wanted to talk to you guys about what? Something brilliant. Brain fart. Make sure you click on my big laughing face so you can subscribe to my channel and I'll put two videos up that you can click on. Go ahead and click on those and keep on watching. I'll see you in the next one. See ya!